what's up everybody this is jed johnson from dieselcrew.com of course you know they call me napalm i've got another unboxing today this one comes from grip and lift australia i'm pretty sure i know what this is but this is going to be a new entry in the hard to handle tournament 2021 to crown the hardest stick bar rolling handle in the world. I can't wait to get into this. So let's go ahead, grab these scissors, then put them right back down because this thing actually tried to work its way out in the shipping process. Look at this. But I'm hoping I'll, yeah, just be able to tear this thing open. Yep, that's what I thought it was. This is the rolling handle from Grip and Lift Australia, and it's called the knuckle handle. So here is the frame of the knuckle. Ooh, what's in here? Ooh, got some extensor bands from Grip and Lift. Look at that. Keep your hands healthy. Avoid tennis elbow. Refrigerator magnet. Sweet. Little explanation for the extensor bands. Let's read this. Oh, I thought it was a letter. This is actually a receipt. So um, the expansion hand bands. Oh, there's a t-shirt in here too. Oh yeah. And then the knuckle handle with four different grips. All right. Very sweet. So let's see what we got here. We got a very narrow handle with 50 on it, so I'm assuming that's 50 millimeters, so a little shy of two inches. We've got a 70 millimeter, which I believe is uh, about two and three quarters inches. We got the 65 and 75. So don't quote me on the on the conversions because I don't have them right in front of me. But that's what we're looking at. Um, sweet man, the t-shirt. Give you a look at this. So when you see that logo, that's Grip and Lift Australia, and I believe um, these Grip and Lift companies are found all over the world. I know there's one in. Canada, and I believe it's all brothers that run the companies, McMurrin Brothers. I've interacted with all of them, and they all seem like really, really good dudes. So thank you, everybody, for, for sending me these, for sending me this stuff. I appreciate the support, and can't wait to see how the handle performs. Just going to move some of this stuff out of the way for the time being so we can look at these handles in a little bit more detail so first off the frame you can pull this pin out that's really easy too by the way that pin comes right out the axle comes out and now you can insert your handles so you just line line this guy up axle goes in pin goes back in where that is so easy I don't have to get a screwdriver out or anything to take that bolt out and then you see here you got three different handles so this is not just for grip sport guys let's look at the rolling action pretty darn smooth this is not uh, metal this is uh, plastic I believe I don't know the specs of it but um, there's going to be some challenge there with getting chalk to stick to it, but we're going to, we're going to do the best that we can. But what I was saying is with these three holes, this can be used for training, not only grip and pulling off the floor or hanging from something and then doing pull-ups or rows with it, but you can also offset your connection point with your carabiner, and then you can train different angles and use this for arm wrestling style training connected to either a cable machine or a band. So, and I'm sure there's plenty of other uses for this, but in a nutshell, that's what you're looking at. Looks like a really strong, high quality piece. 
I don't see anything on here that looks like it's going to, you know, shatter or get damaged. Naturally, you want to take care of your equipment. You don't want to like go throwing it around or dropping it excessively because that can damage it and mar it up. But I mean, this thing, this thing looks sweet as can be. So you're done with this handle. Pull the pin, pull the axle. If you're careful about it, you can keep the axle right in line. Next one goes in. Nice quick transition to a new thickness. And boom, you're ready to go. Looks sweet, man. Looks great. Uh, can't wait to train with it. Thank you, Grip and Lift Australia, for sending me one of your knuckle handles with all of the interchangeable handles. Check those guys out and see what else they offer. There may be some things that you need to add to your, to your training arsenal, especially if you're in Australia. You can avoid some of the, some of the shipping charges that would go along with international shipping. So uh, stay tuned for more information on this. Stay tuned for how this thing performs in the tournament. Once we get it rolling, it'll be taking place after King Kong is over in October of 2021. Thanks a lot, everybody. If you like this video, give it one of these. A big thumbs up, dude. A big one. Make sure to subscribe. I've got more stuff to open up that's going to be coming your way. And any questions, leave a comment below. All the best in your training, everybody. Take care.